Welcome back to Rasmus Stamgaard TV. Today we're making a Negroni, a classic cocktail which is normally bartender's choice. It's what bartenders drink when they are at a bar. They will drink Negroni. There's a reason to that. It's a delicious cocktail. It's a classic. It's um, it's just amazing. I'm gonna teach you how to make it, so you can make it yourself, and then you can feel like a bartender. You know, be like, Hey, I'm a bartender now. I'm doing Negroni. What's up? What's up? Yeah, uh, I've been like that. Or at least like do it your way. Great. So in a Negroni, we have Antigua Formula, Sweet Remove, Campari, Bulldog Gin. The very easy part about making a Negroni is that it's equal parts of these three awesome elements. We're making it in this glass and we're gonna start by taking our mixer glass. This awesome fancy stuff. You're not a cocktail master before you have a mixer glass. Alright, if you don't have a mixer glass, then don't worry, I got you covered. Then you use your normal glass and make it in, uh, in that. Right? I don't have a mixer glass. What should I do? Relax, I got you covered. As mentioned, you can use a normal glass. Relax, alright? We're gonna start off by filling this glass with lots of ice. And then we're also gonna cool down our normal glass where we're gonna have the cocktail. Now we're just gonna add the three awesome elements. We're gonna start off with Campari and just two and a half centiliter of Campari. Then Bulldog Gin, two and a half centiliters. And of course, our Sweet Remove and Tika Formula, two and a half centiliters. So it's like easy to remember. Like you should not forget this recipe. It's like beyond easy. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna stir this awesome cocktail for giving it some more spice and to add some more flavor to this cocktail then we're gonna use some orange zest and put it down to the cocktail again we want to add some charisma to this cocktail we don't want to add some flavors we want to make sure it's absolutely perfect therefore we also want to add some bitters to it so one dash of Orange bitter, one dash of Angostura bitter. And then we're gonna stir this cocktail. And it can take a while. So enjoy yourself and stir it. And then make sure to taste it. Is it good enough for serving or how is it? It's nice. Add a bit more ice because we want to chilling it down, but we don't want to get it too watery. So that's why we, we stir it with lots of ice. Taste again, see if it's good enough. Yummy, great. So now what we're gonna do is throw out this ice and we're gonna fill it up with new ice. And... Oh yeah, oh yeah. That's the way to go. Negroni time. Great. So next up is garnish. Always garnish your cocktail. You want to make it look good. You want to make it look interesting. You know, it's like when you prepare for a night out. You want to make it look gorgeous because that's the way it tastes a lot better. Great. So we're gonna use our orange zest. Take one more orange zest and just squeeze it on top. And then we take this orange test and we make it look good. You know, it's all about it's all about that. So here we go. And a Negroni. It's very simple. It's this one, you should make this one. You should really make it. Bulldog gin, use another gin if you don't have that one, but I recommend a good quality gin. So gin, sweet remove, capari, and you're all set. It's so simple. Those three ingredients, just equal parts. You can make it stronger, you can make it less strong. Do it your way. Then add some bitters, add some orange zest, and you're all good. It's simple, it's easy, it's so delicious. Yeah, before we end, I just wanna finish with four lines for you, because I have a rhyme for this cocktail. So are you ready? I think you are ready. I hope you're ready, because this one is on fire. A cocktail that takes you in a good 
moved. Equal pass, Jin. Can parry and remove. Stirred like a gentleman. Oh, so slowly. True gentlemen's are sipping on Negroni. Boom! Shots fired. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> yeah, so Negroni time. Do it. Just do it. You should really do this. Boom. That was Rasmus Dimegaard TV. Show me some love. Like, subscribe, hit that button. Just like, boom, hit it. Boom. Yeah, cool. Have a good one. Stay the way you are, because I think you're, I think you're doing great. Cool. <laughs> Cheers. Rasmus Dimegaard, over and out.